Hi besties, happy Friday. I hope that you are having a wonderful day and have wonderful quarantine style plans for the weekend. I don't know, guys. Wow, 2020. Anyway, let's not talk about that. So these are the Mifa Perfect, no, no. We have two Mifa Perfect 20s. I did that in the last video. Did you see that? I'm so funny. Um, <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys. So one of you noticed, love chunks, you're the bomb girl, thank you. Um, one of you noticed that the last video, that's the color I painted those nails, by the way. We're gonna draw some mushrooms. There you go, that's what today is. We're doing mushrooms. Um, love chunks, you're the bomb. She noticed, she, she's notification squad goals, you guys. She noticed that I had not, I had uploaded a video with no sound and she she commented on it that there was no sound and I had to fix it and put it, re-put it up. And um, so, oh my goodness, I was like, and here's the thing is that I had uploaded it the night before, it was late at night, I just clicked on the wrong file and um, oopsity doopsities. Because the way that this editing this ridiculous editing program I use, which is free. It's just the Samsung one. Um, it kind of sucks, and uh, but it does what I need it to do. And um, because of the way it works, though, I always end up with a couple of files of the same thing, and um, bef one with sound and one without. And sometimes it's even more files than that, and then a lot of stuff gets deleted. But... Um, Anyways, I didn't like the bottom of this, so we're just going to take it off and I'm going to fix it, you know? That's the beauty of gel, right, guys, that you can just fix things. And honestly, looking at it now, I should have gone more. I should have fixed it more. But, you know, I think it's cute in the end, so that it, it's going to be okay. I'm just, I'm rolling with the homies, y'all, okay? So, <laughs> um, but, yeah, it's, it's a, y'all, it's bad. So the plan in the future, the very nearest future possible, I'm going to get a new computer and a, a better editing program because my computer now is, um, we're moving on to another mushroom. I'm going to make all the tops of the mushrooms, y'all, all the tops. Then we're going to fill in the bottoms and make the stems and everything. I'm just doing all the tops at once, okay? It just seemed like the easiest way for me to accomplish what I wanted. So, there you go. Um, and for some reason, uh, again, because this editing program sucks, I'm going to zoom in and out on this mushroom a couple times. And I know I didn't move the camera. The only, see, in we go, in we go. The only thing that changed is that... Um, on this editing program, it's Samsung Movie Maker... <laughs> uh, when you cut it, like when you zoom in, it, it keeps the zoom in from one clip to the next, even though you don't want to. And even though I have little tricks to kind of make it work, sometimes it doesn't. And that's what you see when that stuff happens. Just like that. So if you're curious why I do that sometimes, I'm not doing it, y'all. But I've already worked, you know... Like maybe it was two hours doing the nails. This one was like an hour and a half, okay? And then I've spent another hour, hour and a half editing it. Maybe more if it was a lot of clips, which this one was. Probably took me like two hours to edit it. I just put something on in the background and because I don't listen to the sound. I don't talk to y'all while I'm doing it. Uh, and today I was watching Star Trek The Next Generation while I edited. But um, so... Once you've already spent, you know, three, four hours on this project, you're like, I don't want to go in there and re-edit it. So sometimes I don't. And that's the case today. There, my little editing rant. <laughs> okay, now we're going to come in. Now, like, I, like uh, I just want to say for sure, I did not show you every single mushroom. It would have been a really long video, and it's already like, 12 or 13 minutes, I want to say. So 
Oh, Y'all would have just been like, hell no. But I did just want to show you, you know, a good chunk of them. This one is, I love this mushroom. It's purple with some cream color and white dots. You'll see at the end. But it's so, so cute. I love it so much. I actually really like this set, you guys. It is, it's only three nails. You would do like two plain nails with something like this if you were going to wear a look like this. And honestly, would it, just imagine, imagine that you are someone who like sells fruits and vegetables at the farmer's market. Can you imagine having these for your farmer's market? Oh, that would be so cute, right? Okay, now that we've done all the tops, we're gonna come in and I'm using this cream color from the, um, the Model One Solid Cream Painting Gels. And we're just gonna make all the stems, wow. That was not focused. Sorry about that, guys. We're gonna make all the stems and anywhere, cause you know, when you look at mushrooms, sometimes you can see their bottom, sometimes they're tilted the other way and you don't. So anywhere that they have the little underneaths, we're gonna use the cream color for that as well. Sorry, I just had to ta stop talking there for a second and catch my breath. I was going pretty fast there for a second. I didn't like that. We're just gonna get rid of it. Now I'm making some grass and I wanna tell you that either, oops, I forgot to record it or oops, I couldn't find it in the clip. Um, it's one or the other. I think I forgot to record the first couple of grass um, blades, I guess, that I did, blades. Um, and I did it in two different parts because I wanted them to be really individual, and if I'd done uh, the crossing ones over wet polish, um, it would not have looked that way. Now we're just coming in with some dots on a few of these mushrooms. Not all of them are going to get dots, and each nail is going to have a tiny little bit of glitter. Not a lot, just a little something something. And of course I had to do dots on the red nails. I just think that's so cute. And again, we pop out for no reason whatsoever. No reason, no rhyme or reason. Now some of them I thought would look better with this chocolatey brown as an outline. And some of them I thought would look better with black. So that's what I did. Um, the more natural colored, like the yellow, well, they're all natural colors, but the green, the yellow, stuff like that, I kept it to the brown. And then um, the pink, the red, the purple, we did those in black. And I'm not going to show, again, I'm not going to show every outline, y'all. You've seen a million outline videos. Here comes the black. Here comes the black. Just to make them pop, make them stand out against that blue background. I think it's not quite, but almost a Tiffany blue. I really like it. It's cute, y'all. Isn't that purple one so cute? I told you I really like it. Honestly, I'm not sure which one's my favorite because I really like the teal one with the yellow dots too. Super cute. They're all cute. It's cute as a group. It's cute as a group. I should have stopped right there with the outlines. Sorry about that, guys. Well, you're here because you like nail art, so I'm going to assume you like it. My analytics don't say that, but I'm gonna assume it anyway. Right? <laughs> that You know what? I think YouTubers, especially in the beginning, you have to be a little delusional. I'm just connecting the grass at the bottom together. I didn't like how it looked empty down there. 
but I think you got to be a little delusional at first because like nobody cares about you in the beginning that happens over time and you've got to now I forgot to um, draw to record drawing this butterfly I'm so sorry you guys it's just a little butterfly I'm outlining in black um, but you've got to assume that at some point somebody's going to give a crap about you and you have to be a little delusional with that belief or it maybe never comes true so here we are coming in with a little bit of glitter y'all this one is the black glitter um, and again this is the model ones um, little gel pots little glitter gels so that's the stage I'm at right now where no, only a few people really give a crap about my channel, and I'm so grateful for every single one of you. And I just have to go on the belief that over time, that number of people is going to grow and be stubborn about it and keep going. And that is exactly what I intend to do. So, welcome to Gigi's delusional nightmare. Or dream. You tell me. So here we are with top coat and time. It is time for top coat. I did, I want to tell you, I did go in with a top coat originally, and I just thought it looked too bumpy, so I did buff it out a little bit and came back in with more top coat. And honestly, I feel like I wish I had done a juicy base coat first, but I didn't. I'm going to forgive myself and just say I think these are very, very cute nails. Let me know in the comment section if you agree with that. Would you wear something this mushroomy? Is this up your alley or is this just, you know, maybe press on, press on heaven. Like you'd wear it for a day or two and once it popped off, you'd be fine. Let me know. While you're down there, click all the other buttons too because that helps the channel grow. And here we are, you guys, all top coated and shiny and beautiful. I really love how this came out. It's almost like a little fantasy mushroom garden. Ah, they're super adorable. Thanks a lot for coming by. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. We're going to see you next week for some awesome stuff because I ordered some new poly gel and I'm going to put it on my fingers this weekend. So we, see you, we will see you for that next week. Mwah. Bye, guys.